particularly need competent helicopter pilots because of the way the country is it's built. You know, there's very limited uh, infrastructure as far as roads go. And there's one big highway that goes all around the place, and it's obviously easy for people to target that. I mean, it's not going to do any good if we secure them here for two years. We have to make them, we have to help them set up a, point, a system that will work, you know, for long term, whether we're here or not. Medical is a big piece because you have ground medics or you have ground personnel that if they get hurt and if they know that uh, nobody's going to come and pick them up, they're not going to want to fight. They're not going to fight at 100 percent. But if they understand that if something happens and they get hurt, there is somebody out there that's going to pick them up. And that is a big morale booster for the uh, ground forces. خاطر از این نزدیک شدیم که به نظامی اشتراک کردیم که به خاطر از این وطن ما در طی چند سال گذشته که جنگ و برادر کشی و به خاطر از این حال آمدیم که وطن ما از آرام شده از جنگ از بین رفته با وطن خود به مردم خود به ملت خود حکومت کنیم از این بدبختی ها از این سیاروزی ها مردم های خود نجات بدیم We've been partnering well, I think, to create a medical system that can continue on in the future and allow us a chance to kind of separate ourselves a little bit and allow the Afghans to run it more for themselves. And the things they learn here will be transferred to civilian health care. Um, so it's, it's all about building health care capacity within Afghanistan so that they can manage uh, more severe patients, more critical patients without anybody else's help.